Hi guys, Tom here, America's favorite hoarder. I have the next great thing in the hoard. Mm. It may or may not be beer, but it may be related to beer. Follow me. Now think about this for a minute. Last year, when the pandemic started, what did everybody gravitate toward? Toilet paper. Don't ask why. But, what is toilet paper made out of? Yes. What is paper in general made out of? Wood. And who's got wood? I do. Not that kind. But as you can see, I've got some 4x4s that I found. A couple of wonderful 2x8s. Nowadays, they're probably 1.5x6 and 3 quarters. People are throwing these things away, not really realizing the value. So let's take a walk into my backyard. This is from this morning. <laughs> a squeaky gate. But anyway, now think about it. You see wood on the side of the road constantly. I never place any value on it. But nowadays, what used to cost two and a half dollars for a two by four by eight foot long board is now costing, according to a friend of mine that's in the construction business, nine and a half dollars at Home Depot. So, this guy is rebuilding his deck. I'm grabbing his excess wood. And again, not the head kind of wood but I've got 4x4s, four I've got plywood, 4x4 four four fencing post, fencing pickets if you want to call them that. So, I may build a shed for my shed. My little garden isn't doing anything yet. It's still too early. But back to the wood. Mm, this one has a sticker on it. Let's see if there's a price on it. I just noticed that. This one. Pro wood. For ground contacted use, so it's treated 4x4x8. Four by four by and of course, there's no limited lifetime warranty for as long as you own it. Hmm. There it is. So, don't throw wood away. Don't think about it. Besides the Charlie, the, yeah, pardon me, yeah. The beer is taking effect. Besides the toilet paper last year, what else do they make out of wood? Houses, garages, porches, decks. D-E-C-K-S. Just to make sure the spelling is correct. And one other thing. Charcoal. What's going to happen in the United States in the summertime when people can't buy charcoal? Because a bag of charcoal gets went from two dollars and fifty cents to fifteen dollars there will be a civil war it's not going to be because of the presidential election which was obviously fraudulent or food stamps running out because the United States government is finally going broke it's going to be, be because nobody can afford charcoal briquettes for their barbecue well there it is. There's the real reason. You heard it here. Think about it. It sounds silly, and I might sound silly, but two and a half dollars for a two by four, please. Or I'm sorry, nine and a half dollars for a two by four, which used to cost two and a half dollars just a couple months ago. Nobody will be able to afford doing any remodeling. You can't build a workbench in your basement. Can't even build a basement. You won't be able to build any new houses. The price of a new house is going to go up to five hundred thousand dollars instead of a hundred thousand dollars. So maybe I'm on to something here. I'll just start collecting this stuff now. And if I'm wrong, having more fencing for my garden or burn material because I don't buy charcoal. I don't like propane. And I don't have the patience for charcoal. Some people do. But 
And no, I'm not going to wipe my butt with boards. Even if we run out of toilet paper. There's plenty of leaves around. But, being silly, I digress again. That's all for now. Some things to think about. If you see wood on the side of the road, grab it. That's all for now. Thanks for hoarding. Bye-bye.